Well, Biff, it looks like the lower life forms have taken the lead. Mm, that's right, Buzz Buzz. And just as well, I think they've done something for the self esteem of fur covered animals everywhere. <laughs> Tom and Jerry, as the only surviving drivers in our super race, we're giving you two nuclear-powered rocket car jet plane hovercraft things. And, uh, there's a teensy change in plans. You've only got five minutes to finish the race. That's right. Once you racers leave Borneo, you'll cross Europe and the Atlantic Ocean to the good old U.S. of A. There, you'll cross the continent to reach the finish line in Hollywood, California, in five minutes! <laughs> So, good luck, and may the best lower species win! Imperious ruler of the Red Planet, 
keeper of the squink diddlies of Sprong, holder of the scepter of Phoebus and all around swell guy, King Thing! to be the great gloop, the one spoken of in the ancient scrolls. You are correct, Grob. It is he, the great gloop. The great gloop has returned to us. Huzzah! 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 At last! What a great day! Let the celebration begin! For the infinite wisdom you will bring to us, we offer you these gifts. Sire. How dare you interrupt the royal feast? I'm sorry, sire, but a giant has infiltrated the walls of the city. Is this a joke? There are no such things as giants. The giant! leaves the pussycat, the mouse, and of course, Rami. Yes, and here they are. Let's have a word with Grammy. Say, Grammy, I'm sure the folks at home would like to know how you feel about the race thus far. Well, it's a wonderful competition. It's good for a person to participate in old-fashioned, clean... Wholesome fun!
Ugh, pussycat. How are you going to sleep at night after a rotten trick like that? Well, I think you'll sleep just fine, Buzz. Looks like the pussycat is in the lead. Well, it seems we are down to only two competitors now, Biffy. That's right. A cat and a mouse. The predator and the prey. The overdog and the underdog. The eater and the eaten. The big and the small. Okay, Biff, I think we get the idea. I'm beat. Well, before you sit down, I have a surprise for you. Oh, is it a big, juicy steak? Good boy, Tom. How's our Tootsie doing? Tootsie? Not another mouth to feed. It's not going to be expensive to feed her. Just one food pellet per meal. to watch after a hard day's work. Tootsie, show Rick. Run on your wheel. <laughs> okay, let's give it a try. But if one more animal enters this house, then someone's got to go.
Ooh, I'm starving. Honey, how's that steak coming along? Steak? What steak? It's leftover casserole. Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> this is no time for playing around. I want to check on Tootsie. Move, cat! <laughs> Upstairs! <laughs> Do something! I'm searching! Oh, got it! Hello? Helping hands, hands to rescue? Get over here! Stop! on this puzzle, and I won't have you tearing around the house. or it's back into the cage you go. So there are no hard feelings. There'll be a bowl of milk waiting if you're good. Okay. out of you, and I'll launch your tail into the moon!
Why do you provoke me, cat? Stop. <laughs> this thing could stop a tank. <sighs> oh, Rick. Honey. sewing kit. My mask keeps slipping. They're gonna see my face. Just pull your collar up. You'll be fine. Burglars? No! Spike, no! They're in costume! In the backyard! How's I supposed to know everyone was in costume tonight? Hey, Cat, maybe he's got the right idea after all. How's about sharing some of that grub? <laughs> Ow! And... Oh, not again. <laughs> uh, honey? Uh-oh, what happened? Never should have gotten this worthless thing. I'm just gonna toss it out. Oh, <laughs> well. So long, kitty. Poor old Tom. Let's eat! Look at all that wealth! Well, I saw a ghost. I got a genius plan to get us in. Nice going, guys. You work with Rick, right? Oh, let me help you with that. Please, come on. In. I love what they've done with the place. Oh, I beg your pardon. You look very familiar. Have we met before? You know, I think I've seen him somewhere too. I never forget a face. Hey, cut it out. This is your rented costume. <laughs> What the? No, oh, that's it. You okay, Uncle Jack? Go on, put me someplace I can't interfere. I did it again, didn't I? Hey, great idea. I'll just watch from out here. Better yet. Hello? Keep up the good boy, Cap! Sounds like you're making some real progress! You 
ain't done yet. in playing games with some bratty buck. Hand caught. That's good stuff. <clears throat> I mean, uh, sorry, bub. It would take a lot more than some can of fish I can't even open to buy my help. Well played. Don't worry, fellas, I'll handle this. Me and the little guy is gonna have us a friendly game of Old Maid. I'm going in! Oh, yeah! I win again! I win again! <laughs> Who's the Old Maid? Who's the Old Maid? That's right, it's Tyke! <laughs> Where's your teeth, Granny? You better get... <laughs> Take my advice. <laughs> Rick, whose turn is it to fill Tom's water dish? Yours? Okay, but I guess it's your turn to take care of the litter box then. <laughs> Ready? Okay, you can have one refill, but that's it for now.
steaks are grilled to perfection. And as always, the first one is for my favorite pooch. Spike, here, boy, come and get it. I always like to keep a souvenir from a great meal. Come and get it! Like, look at his belly. I can't even fit in my own doghouse anymore. No matter what I say or do, promise me you won't give it back to me. Understand? Gee, thanks. You're not actually gonna keep that, are you? Give it here! Hey! Oh, I get a terrible cold here. That means you're watching, Tyke, so's I can rest all recuperating like. You make sure nothing happens to my boy, or you're getting fist ta ta for lunch. Got it? Uh, good. Ask <laughs> you! Uh, okay then, I'm going back to bed. <laughs> Sure, that happens to my boy. at all. You guys are playing mailman like we do. No fist topped off for you, cat. Nighty night. Unless my boy gets hurt. I mean, old cat. I bet Uncle Jerry could get the splinter out. Hey, cat! What's going on in there? Mike, you okay? Cat, you hearing me? Don't make me beat you with this door! Stop 
you're blubbering. Should we help the silly cat, Uncle Jer? Hear me, cat? You got to the count of three to open this door. One, two, three! You hiding something, cat? What are you up to? <sighs> Playing cowboys with my boy? Ain't that the sweetest? Forgive me for thinking bad of you, cat. It's just mean old cold talking. <laughs> It won't be long, Tyke boy. Tyke? Have you seen my boy? Hang on, boy. I'm coming for you. Is one hair on his head. Get it? You're gonna have a pool by the end of the day, Tyke boy, if it's the last of me. Coming. Sorry. <laughs> Listen, cat, I'm napping here. Wake me again, and I'm pounding you good. That's right, Tyke. And my boy's in charge. Got it? Uh-uh. It's not time for cake, little guy. Your party guests haven't even arrived yet. Uh, of course, you are the birthday boy. I guess one little taste won't hurt nobody. <laughs> That's my boy. What the? Tyke! Son, what are you doing? It appears the little guy didn't know the bones belonged to his dad. He just thought he was really good at finding them. You did this for me?
Nice try, cat. We'll get you to the doctor. No need to thank me, pal. Just lay there. You gotta pull this tooth. What are you waiting for? Do it! Do it! Sorry, cat. It's a reflex. I couldn't help myself. They can squeeze you in at five. We'll leave when I get back. Okay. So that didn't go the way I was hoping. This time, it's gonna be different. See? Now I won't know what's coming. Go ahead. Did you do it? Reflexes again. Oh, this tooth! I'm not thinking straight. You gotta figure something out. You one smart cat. Couldn't hurt you if I wanted to. And I want to. Now pull it! Sorry, cat. It's this tooth. It's taken over my body. I'm begging you. Now I'm telling you, pull the tooth or feel my pain. Oh, 
punch, pal. I'm hurting, and you will be too, unless someone does something about this too. And where are you going, cat? One of you's two, both of you's two, I don't care. This tooth gotta go. to lose confidence. Phone? Penguin cartoons, Tom? Really? Keep it up and you'll have a new forever home, too. And put that vacuum away. It's not a toy. stuff. Got it? I found Button a forever home. That's great, honey. Aw, thank you, Thomas. I don't know where you come from, but am I glad to see you. Come on. A dog can't leave an old lady alone, but I gotta get out of here. This place is driving me nuts! 
This ought to let me off the hook. Good luck, pal. Now, let's see about that cute kitty, Tim. Oh, my. What a tiny kitty you are. Don't worry. You'll get plenty to eat here. But you won't find any mice. I just can't abide them. Ambrose, uh, come here and say hello to my nephew's kitty cat, Tim. Now be a good doggy and show Tim how much you love him. Go on, Ambrose. There we go. Who's a good doggy? That's right. Who's a good doggy? That's a good boy. Let's all get something to eat. Now I've baked a special dessert for today. Good, Ambrose. Let our guests eat first. Uh, now, Timmy, what would you like to try first? Don't worry, Ambrose. I saved a special soup bone just for you. <laughs> what is it, Timmy? Oh, it's so good to see you and Ambrose getting along. He's so well trained. Now, there's something you should like. Kitties love to play with yarn. Uh, uh, go get the yarn, Timmy. <laughs> It's all right. Go ahead and play with the yarn. Oh, that's just wonderful, Timmy. Look at him go, Ambrose. He's so talented. Uh, my goodness, he's fast. Such a treat to have a kitty in the house. Now, Ambrose, if you're done playing with the kitty, I'll need my yarn back. Here's a saucer of milk for you, Timmy. You can spend time outside while I kick Ambrose for his walk. Have fun while we're gone. Come on, Ambrose. Oh, Ambrose, I hope you're having fun. But I saved the best for last. Your most favorite place, the dog park. There you are. Oh, dear. All the other doggies are sleeping. Let's wake them so you can all play. the bowl! Crazy mouse! Are you off your cheese? You better concentrate on catching that cat, or else you are out.
Your six minutes are up. I hope you enjoyed your fantasy brain game. Please come back and see us again. Now my set is ruined. Oh, uh, sorry, sir. Oh, we are just in the middle of a strong man. Oh, you want to be a tough guy, huh? Well, why don't you give me ten of these? And you can give me ten of these. No, 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 no. I give up. I ain't tough. I guess I am a gentleman. 